Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Crypto Market Daily. This is your boy Bobby B in the house. 908, whoa, whoa, 908 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. We hope you guys are having a good day. I hope you guys had fun and I hope you guys are ready. We got a lot to cover. Welcome, everybody. Solana Army in the house. Crypto Market Daily. This is your boy. Holla at me. Let me see. See, yeah. All right. So, Dogecoin and the rest of the market looking very nice. We're going to take a quick look at the DXY. You know what? No. Cut. We're breaking from our normal broadcasting. We got an emergency alert. BTC right now on the weekly. We know that today was our weekly close. And guess what, ladies and gentlemen? Yes, if you look to the left, there is a heart. 1618 Fibonacci at 20,869 does look like we got a bounce currently at the time of this recording 21148. We have found that support. Is this possibly our new line of support and our continuation on? Up. We're gonna circle this for you. We're gonna leave this here. Weekly chart looking good and closing in the green. MACD is super low, right around 27 on the week. We know that that's very low. Anything around that in the 20s for me is a buy area. So that is what I'm doing. I'm putting a heart and a white circle right around that 20 thousand eight hundred dollar mark that is the six one six one eight and it's a possible reversal line so smash up that like and subscribe ladies and gentlemen does look we're gonna clean these charts up we're gonna we left all this from our morning um video so that everybody can see that does look like this is playing out we are bouncing right there right around that two uh sorry twenty thousand eight twenty two i had a little tongue twister going on so overhead resistance right around that twenty one eight and if we get above that we are still predicting a twenty two six twenty one run to the upside so we're being very calm we're monitoring you know we want to be realistic here we want to see what we're doing we're ready to boom pow break through these lines of resistance and we're ready to move up you know so we're being patient and we're ready to spread this good news as of right now that volume does look like it is rather non-existent i'll be honest with you not looking a hundred percent great but the rsi at 45 i was gonna say 44 but not 45 has definite room to run and our magd does look like it is curling to the upside we're going from red to pink that means that those bulls are stepping in and boom, pushing away those bears and saying, not today, buckaroo. First line of resistance, right around that 21.8. Second line of resistance, 22.6. Crypto Market Daily, we love you guys. And again, we're circling that volume because it's not there. So we need those bulls to step in. Boom shakalaka. So, nine. Th this is our total crypto market cap. 930 getting a fat rejection man i've been waiting to say that because you know what rejections are good like i said you gotta get rejected in order to find a place where we're gonna bounce that's at 919 looks like that 900 billion dollar held looking to break that 950 and then overhead resistance is that one trillion dollar mark we said it once FOMO major kicks in right around that press range. Okay, jumping on the cell. So my soul army, where are you right now? Finding a bounce and support right around 38. And then boom, 39 right now. Pow, getting a fat rejection at our first overhead resistance at $40.20. RSI does look like it does have a lot of room to run and our volume looks really good. So I'm predicting that we are going to boom, we're going to push through this and continue on up. How much more will we go? Well, I think we need to get past that $42 price range and then we will continue up $44.64. We're using the white lines. The yellow lines were so yesterday. Now we're doing the white. Okay, so I'm glad you guys are holding on this long. 
We love all of you guys. A lot to cover today. A lot of movement to the downside, to the left, to the right. A little crab movement for some. But right now, we are finding that upward movement. So, MACD is curling up RSI, like I said, with a lot of room to run at 46. And this is what we want to see. We want to see those bulls step in, which is what we're seeing with our volume, thickening up. So, continuing on. All right. I'm, I don't want to get too excited, but I am. All right. Next up, my baby boy. Whoa, those are a lot of lines. Well, we're going to clean it all up. We got a fat rejection. We did a triangle. I thought we were going to break to the upside. 43.31 was my price point. Wrong right now. At the time of this recording, 37.10. So, we have got fat rejection. We did circle this bottom uh support smash up that like and subscribe for your boy we did circle this bottom 35 10 i didn't think it was gonna go that low we circled it anyway and guess what it hit so clearing up our charts our 3909 flipped from support into resistance and now our support at 35 10 is still in effect right now it looks like we are getting a little bit of a move up 3719 at the time of this recording we want to get back up and smash through that overhead resistance right around that 3909 price point so if we can just get a very nice amount of buyers to step in and just continue to move up this will just be a normal correction down we don't want to fall off the table back to where we were we want to continue up volume has most definitely thickened up the last time i checked 62 percent up also, RSI with room looks like we have reset at 42. And guess what? Our MACD indicator is showing us that it is beginning to curl back up. All these are very good signs that we are finding our support. We want to we want to add in at support and then we want to get out at resistance. Or, or rather, you just don't want to buy at resistance. Okay, so this is what I do. Not financial, but literature. Okay, here we go. Sheba! Also getting a fat rejection. That yellow line, I thought we were going to go to 1296. We only got to around 1201, so that's going to flip to our resistance now. Currently 1160. Got to break above that 12 to continue on up. Volume does look relatively nice. We do have a lot of support under us. That's very good. We need those bulls to step in. RSI, again, with room to run and our MACD curling up. Last but not least, Dogecoin. Wow. Look at that volume. We said it once and we'll say it again. I hope you guys held this long. Volume will always dictate the price. Right now, we are above our seven. We said lucky number seven. We're looking to break out of these sevens. And once we do that, ladies and gentlemen, the only overhead resistance we have is around the 10. So volume is thickening up. RSI with room to run at 60. I mean, that's that's okay. And then we are unfortunately in the red. So it does look like we are probably going to get a little bit of sideways action. But as soon as we break above out of our overhead resistance at 077, there is no resistance, ladies and gentlemen, to about 107. So that's about a 30% move. That's a wow factor. Where am I? Where's my Dogecoin? We're going to have a move, and I believe it's coming. So this is, I accidentally clicked it. I don't want to click Luna. But Luna is moving. I'm still holding Luna, by the way. Also for my, you know, my Luna ticks out there. We love you guys. Terra, tearing it up today also and yesterday. So looking like a sea of green. Ladies and gentlemen, we just covered a lot. It is 9, 16 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. This is our daily video update. We're trying to be nice and calm. We don't want to freak everybody out. So... We are level-minded, okay? And so should you. Crypto Market Daily. This is your boy, Bobby B in the house. Smash up that like, subscribe, and like always, guys. As always. Peace out. Woo! I love you guys. We'll see you guys in the morning, okay? I kind of don't even want to stop hanging out. I want to hang out all night. So, we got to go live pretty soon. We love you guys. We'll see you guys pretty soon. Love one another, guys. This is a wow moment. Crypto. Peace out.